Faroe Islands, a place where sheep outnumber humans, stunning natural beauty and historical whale hunting. Situated in the North Atlantic Ocean, the Faroe Islands form an archipelago of 18 captivating islands. Nestled between Iceland and Norway, these islands create a picturesque haven with their rugged cliffs, majestic waterfalls and lush green landscapes. While the Faroe Islands are part of the Kingdom of Denmark, they have their government, language, flag and national identity. They have extensive autonomy and handle their internal affairs independently. Renowned for their ever-changing weather conditions, the Faroe Islands are said to encompass all four seasons in a single day, making it an exciting and unpredictable destination. Similar to Iceland, the Faroe Islands experience the mesmerizing phenomenon of the midnight sun during the summer months. Conversely, the winter brings polar nights, where the sun remains below the horizon for extended periods. The history of the Faroe Islands dates back over a thousand years when it was initially settled by Irish monks. However, it was the Vikings who left an indelible mark on these lands. In the 9th century, Norse settlers arrived, establishing a thriving farming and fishing community that laid the foundation for the island's culture and traditions. Fast forward to the 14th century, when the Faroe Islands became part of the Kingdom of Norway. Over the centuries, the islands changed hands several times before coming under Danish rule in the 19th century. Today, the Faroe Islands enjoy a high degree of autonomy, boasting its government and a distinct cultural identity. An intriguing fact is that the Faroese language spoken by the locals originates from Old Norse, the language of the Vikings. Despite being one of the world's smallest language communities with around 50,000 speakers, the Faroese people take immense pride in their language and culture, preserving their traditions through storytelling, music and traditional Faroese dance. An extensive network of underwater tunnels interconnects the Faroe Islands, serving as crucial transportation links between the islands and facilitating residents' access to essential services. Surprisingly, the Faroe Islands are home to more sheep than humans. While the population hovers around 53,000 people, approximately 70,000 sheep freely roam the islands. This unique breed of sheep is called the Faroese sheep. Faroese sheep are known for their thick wool and their ability to survive in the harsh climate of the Faroe Islands. In 2016, the Faroe Islands took an innovative approach to landscape mapping by attaching cameras to the backs of sheep, creating a unique virtual tour called Sheep View 360. This endeavor aimed to capture the breathtaking vistas of the islands from a distinctive perspective. The Faroe Islands boast an impressive array of bird species. The bird cliffs, particularly on the island of Mykens, attract thousands of puffins, guillemots and other seabirds during the nesting season, offering spectacular bird watching opportunities. On the island of Vagar, there is a fascinating phenomenon called Lake Sorvasvatn. The lake appears to be floating high above the ocean due to an optical illusion created by the surrounding landscape. Tyndall Moor is an impressive rock formation located off the west coast of Vagar Island. It consists of several towering sea stacks rising dramatically from the ocean, creating a striking and otherworldly sight. Kalsoy, one of the Faroe Islands, is home to the iconic Kalur Lighthouse. Perched atop a rugged cliff, the lighthouse offers breathtaking panoramic views of the surrounding sea, islands, and dramatic landscapes. The 
Faroese practice a traditional form of sustainable whaling known as Grindadrap. This practice involves driving pilot whales to the shore for hunting and the meat is shared within the community. While it has faced criticism from animal rights groups, the annual Grinda Drap remains a cultural event for some Faroese. Skirpikjot is a traditional Faroese dish made from air-dried mutton or lamb. The meat is hung in the open air for months, allowing the cold winds to naturally cure it. This delicacy is enjoyed thinly sliced and has a unique flavor and texture. In 2015, the Faroe Islands garnered international attention as they witnessed a total solar eclipse. This rare astronomical event attracted thousands of tourists and astronomers who flocked to the islands to experience the phenomenon in all its glory. Traditional Faroese houses, known as turf-roofed houses, are covered with grass. This traditional building technique offers insulation and protection against harsh weather conditions. Torshavn, the capital city of the Faroe Islands, is renowned for its charming multicolored houses. These traditional wooden houses are painted in vibrant hues, lending a picturesque and cheerful ambiance to the city's streets. The Faroe Islands offer a unique blend of stunning natural landscapes, a rich cultural heritage, and a close-knit community. Despite their sparse population, these islands have preserved their distinct identity. Thriving in various industries while maintaining a solid connection to their Viking past.